Hi beauties, welcome back to my channel, it's Bernice. Today I'm going to be showing you guys lip swatches of all of my 21 Mega Last Wet n Wild lipsticks. I hope you guys are excited because I am excited, I love these lipsticks. I just want you guys to know what I know and share with you guys. And I hope you really enjoy this because my lips are going to be in pain after this video. Just to let you know, this is not a lipstick from Wet n Wild, it is from Lime Crime and it's Glamour 101. It's gorgeous. It's the only Lime Crime lipstick that I have. I do have I do have two of the Velveteens, which is Red Velvet and Pink Velvet. I can't remember what the name was, but I do have those two. But that's a different video in itself. So let's get started. I'm going to be doing all lip swatches and maybe some arm swatches. I'm not sure yet. Um... So I am going to be doing this on my lips, and I'm not going to be talking through it because if I do, it's going to be like a million hour long video, so let's get right into this video. Uh, and I am going to be doing lightest to darkest, that way it doesn't stain my lips too early on, because these lipsticks actually do stain your lips, so the dark ones do. Mm -hmm. Let's get started. Maybe I will talk through this. The first color is Just Beachy. Is bear it all and it is more of a browner nude color which I think is perfect for my skin tone the next color is sandstorm which is a nice light brown color which I like browns and deep purple so I'm kind of weird but I think it just looks really nice on my skin tone the next color is rosebud which is a darker it leans on the more dark pink side which I like better than light pink lipsticks because light pink does does not look good on me <laughs> which is more leaning towards a purpley brown um, color and I just love 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 this color I had to buy this lipstick on drugstore.com because they don't have it in CVS Walgreens Walmart anywhere that you sell wet and wild so I had to buy this on drugstore.com and it took like a week to get and it's amazing I love this color I will definitely definitely repurchase this is Mochalicious which is as you can tell by the name a brown color which I think leans more to kind of a brown gray I really like the effect it has on my lips and it really does bring out my yellow undertones the next color is don't blink pink which I don't know if you can tell in the viewfinder it doesn't look like you can really tell this is a super super like Nicki Minaj bright pink like super pink and um, I don't know if I would wear this every day it is really really bright I would never wear it to work it's kind of out of my comfort zone for me dark purples and browns are my comfort zone and like light pinks are out of my comfort zone I know it's kind of weird like I like black almost black lipsticks like that's my comfort zone light pinks out of my comfort zone I know it's weird but yeah so don't blink pink is this color Dollhouse pink. If you think 
dollhouse pink looks good on me let me know down below in the comments I really like to know what you guys think about this color on me because I don't think it meshes with my skin Tinkerbell and it's a very very Barbie pink lipstick I don't know if it's showing up on camera or not but it is in person super Barbie pink imagine just the original Barbie with the pink pink lips that's this it's Tinkerbell it's a no-go for me it just clashes with my skin color I love the pigmentation I love the color does not look good on me Next color is mauve out of here and man oh man is this my favorite pinky purple color like it's a purple but it has pink undertones and I think that this color really does just look good on my skin tone sorry I didn't know what to say for that but I like this pinky purpley color and it's my favorite out of all the pinks that I have out of the pinks that I just showed you um, it's my favorite I just Next color is Wine Room, which is leaning more towards the dark pinks instead of the fuchsia pinks, and I also really love this color. The next color is Smokin' Hot Pink, which leans more towards the red of the pink spectrum, I don't know how to explain it. But um, this pink I can definitely pull off with my skin tone because it's a warmer pink, it's not a bright pink. The next color is Cherry Picking and I absolutely love this hot pink almost red lipstick like it looks like it's on the verge of being red but it's still a pink and oh my gosh it's gorgeous I know I've been saying that about all of the lipsticks but this one is just amazingly gorgeous if you color is pretty persimmon I think that's how you say it it is a very orangey red lipstick it leans a lot more on the orange side so um, it's a very bold statement lipstick and I just I think it's gorgeous and I think it does look good with my skin tone I haven't worn it that much because it's got more into winter when I bought it so um, definitely during the springtime I'm gonna wear this bad boy <laughs> red velvet and it is a very beautiful soft red color it's not a very dramatic like BAM spotlight stoplight red apple I don't know how to explain it it's just a light soft um, red color <laughs> color is called Stoplight Red and it's just a gorgeous classic red color. It does have a little bit of shine to it but it is a very matte uh, lipstick. has no glitter whatsoever and I think if you want a classic red lipstick for very cheap go to CVS or Walgreens and check this bad boy out because it's a dollar ninety nine and it's amazing. It stays on so perfectly, so flawlessly, does not feather out. I can wear this to work to I but you I can go running with this bad boy and stay on my lips so yeah definitely if you're into red lips classic red lips check out stoplight red so the last colors are all dark colors as you can tell here 
So if you don't like dark colors, you can go ahead and skip on out of here. But uh, if you do, keep on watching. The next color is Raven Raisin, and it is a dark purpley color, and it's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous purple color. The next color is Sugar Plum Fairy, which I think I talked to you guys about in one of my favorite videos, that I just love this darn lipstick so freaking much. It's my shiz right here. I love, love, love Sugar Plum Fairy and I wear it to work and I just love it. I don't care if it's not fall. I don't care if it's spring. I don't care if it's summer. I love this lipstick. color is cinnamon spice which looks more of like a brick red brown color and I just love love brick red colors and this is just gorgeous I am starting to look crazy my lipsticks going all out of the lines and it's just uh, but I'm down to my last two, and this one is Cherry Bomb, which I love because it's like a red leaning on the very dark purple side of the spectrum, which is gorgeous because you know me, I love me some purples. And red. <laughs> But certainly not least is Vamp It Up from Wet n Wild. Look at this gorgeous black purple lipstick. It's amazingly pigmented. It looks just like Max Cyber, probably more pigmented though, and creamy and rich. And it doesn't dry out your lips that bad within the first like two to three hours. After that, it starts getting drying and you know, just the basic with wet and wild lipsticks um, but look how white my teeth look wearing this like come on it's gorgeous this is my favorite lipstick out of the whole line vamp it up I had to go on drugstore.com to get it so if you want this color definitely check out drugstore.com and they have it there for $2.49 I believe instead of $1.99 like the regular drugstores but um yeah I just I didn't even care how much it cost I wanted this lipstick so video I hope you guys enjoyed this video I enjoyed making it my lips did not enjoy making it because they are hurting right now but you know what they're not hurting so bad because I used Carmax and the EOS lip balm in between so I mean each time I just put that on in between and you know worked out good so I hope you guys liked this video please thumbs up and comment down below any suggestions you have for any um, videos that you want to see this year and I should be having a collab a Disney collab with some other youtubers um, at the end of February hopefully if everything works out right I should be having that up soon um, I think February 28th is when she wants to have the videos up so we'll see um, but yeah so I hope you guys like this video I hope you guys have a wonderful amazing day and I will talk to you guys in my next video bye beauties